Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing great today. Today I got a game from LB Pun. He's one of my fellow VX9 clan mates, and he's in his uh, Tiger 2, as you can see. And he's on the Fisherman's Bay map, which, man, I love this map. And uh, he's going to take this thing into town and just go shopping for souls. And he's going to help his team win. He's going to put out, man, it's just a beautiful thing to watch. He has a really great game, and he sent it to me, and I'm really happy to show it off for him. I really do hope you like it. This is your first time here. Thank you so much for stopping by and checking every checking out the channel. I really do hope you like it too. And uh, all you returning folks that that uh, sending me these games and watching the videos and leaving comments and stuff, man, you guys are just motivating me to keep putting out more content. I really do appreciate it. Anyway, y'all, let's get to the video. Thanks for watching. Good old Fisherman's Bay map. I love this map. I say that. I know I say that about a lot of maps, but I really do like this one, especially when I'm in the TD, man. It's just a great, great sniping map, great light tank map, and it's a pretty good heavy map. And CB has got, as you can see, he's in his Tiger 2. He's got the festive, um, what is that, the carnival, the carnival uh, camo on there for Brazil. It has a, you know, Rio and all that, and they have that the carnival down there. It's kind of like the their version of Mardi Gras. Well, maybe Mardi Gras is, ver is our version of Carnival. Yeah, either way, it's kind of the same thing. They have a good time before before Lent starts. And uh, anyway, he's gonna take this take his ti you know take this tiger tiger two into town, and he's not gonna be throwing beads. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's gonna be throwing a bunch of bunch of misery around is what he's gonna be doing. And there goes the T thirty four eighty five M and. IS-2M is, he's knocking down trees, he's gonna snipe the center is what it looks like. There's the EBR Hotch, and uh, it looks like the Cromwell is on fire, which is a beautiful thing. He just can't get quite reloaded quick enough to take a shot on him. He probably would have killed him if he'd have got a shot on him. Yeah, it is what it is, but he's gonna pull up here in this bush directly in front of him, by this, on the corner of this little house right here. He's gonna be able to shoot down the lane. And immediately he's going to spot the TNH-105. Well, he doesn't spot him, but he's you know he's going to line up on him, and he's going to get a crack and good shot in the front lower plate for 334. It's beautiful, man. Um, he gets lit up again. He's going to take another shot and hits him for 408. Man, that's wonderful. He's already shaved off 742 of this dude's hit points. Already he's getting in on some of the action. Looks like he didn't, didn't like he hit him. P43 is sitting over here. Um, he just got hit in the face. He's backing up. You uh, know, LB's waiting for him to pull out. Dude knocks a tree down. He's going to poke. That's not the way you go around the corner, man. LB's just shaved off 1,067 of his dude's hit points. Um, yeah, he, he's. I mean, he, yeah, he, he pulled up, but he hasn't really accomplished a whole lot. Um, He's about to die. His his the rest of his team has done a good job of capturing the center of the map. They have good map control. Um, the EBR is pushing into like where the little uh, uh, what's it the windmill area um, where the where the enemy TDs usually sit. And so he's giving his teammates something to shoot at. It looks like the. The T-3485M got ammo racked by the TNH-105, and then, like, as soon as he did that, the Super Hellcat killed him, and then the enemy's uh, T-3485M destroyed, killed the Super Hellcat, tit for tat, you know. There's a VK-4503 pre premium tier 7 heavy, which paper thin armor, he can, you can, LB can pin him at any angle. All LB just has to do is point and shoot, and it's going to pretty much an auto pin. With this uh, tier eight, yeah, aim for the X. There you go. Shaves off 361 of his hit points, and he gets taken out by the Progetto 46. Man, it's a good thing you didn't get hit by that one. That, that tank is going to be giving him the business to the, um, the Crusader. 
is going to be giving him the business the whole game. And that, that thing hurts when he get hit by that, that stinking thing. He's going to, he's wisely backing up in the cover. I mean, It's like one of the enemy teammates just either he, he uh, drowned himself on purpose or I, I don't know, but he's dead. The primo, the primo Victoria, the the <laughs> their medium. Uh, I don't know what why he did that. I mean, I don't know. Maybe he went around the corner too quick and <laughs> slipped off. I don't know. LB's checking around to make sure there's usually a heavy or somebody sitting right there sniping across. He was just wanting to make sure there was nobody over there. Just checking, you know, checking all his checking all his corners. And there's nobody there. And he's gonna start down this uh seawall right here. Usually usually uh the already like to hang over in the bushes over there by that bridge. And sure enough, there's the SU eight. He's gonna take that that tank out it's beautiful as you can see his team is they're up by two but man that crusader just just beat the piss out of him for 476 man what did he smash you in the face more like bonked you on the top of the head and what, what's the watch the super hellcat coming well he's coming look at him, look at him go <laughs> he is hauling tail man uh, he's looking at LB, but he ain't shooting. Uh, it doesn't do very well on the, on the go. <laughs> I don't know where this dude was. Maybe he was going to go drown himself too. <laughs> I don't know. I don't get that that move at all. But anyway, he got smashed again by that stinking Crusader, man. Some good, some good communication occurring between the S caliber and the, the E4. Um, T26 E4 that is I tell him man don't don't look around the wall that you 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 got him proxy spotted you know no, no need to peek and die <laughs> LB's going down this uh down this low lot low area here see if he can spot anybody this is how you know this is where the TD the heavies usually end up you, you fought you made it way through town and now you're in this this uh, TD killing zone life of a heavy he hits the T25 slat, you know, two, tier seven, American TD. And one of his teammates takes him out. Progetto 46 takes him out. Now he's get he got hit by the Dicker Max for 290. Gonna return the favor, 354. Thank you very much. He's trying to get get in a little bit of a little bit of cover behind this rock right here. He's, he's only got 529 hit points. He's not not a one shot for anybody. Well, I mean, if you got ammo racked, you would be, but yeah, man. Like I said, his team did a great job of, of pushing, great map control, pretty much from the beginning of the game on. I mean, they never stopped pushing, which is good on them. You know, you. You put them on their you put the enemy on their heels from the get, and if you can keep that pressure on, a lot of the time, man, it works out for you. And there's the Dicker Max; he got spotted again. He's lining up a shot, takes it, takes him out, which is beautiful. That's his third kill. He's gonna start to cross the runway. And there's that pesky crusader. Beautiful. Beautiful shot. Like he's gonna take out one of the hurricanes. And yeah, it's gonna have to <laughs> it's gonna be a class A mishap right there. <laughs> man, great, great game, man. Great game. Four kills, man. You killed the SU eight, the Super Hillcat, the Dicker Max, and the Crusader. You got the Prescucci medal for killing both their light tanks, man. High caliber. You did 37, 15 in damage. You had 1,032 in assist damage for a combined 47, 47. 
Um, you block 640, and you got three spots, man. And you got, to, like I said, you got the Prescucci's medal, high caliber, and a litany of second class master badge, fighter for four kills, man. Duelist, sp spotter. <laughs> man, you had a great game, dude. And you made a pile of credits, 71,000 credits, dude. Outstanding, man. So this game paid off for you all the way around. Man, I really like that camo. It looks good on that tank, man. Anyway, LB, thank you for sending me the game, dude. I really do appreciate it. Uh, everybody else, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it's your first time here. If you like what you see, please consider subscribing. It really helps me out. And if the video was not complete garbage due to me, please consider leaving a thumbs up and a com you know comment for LB. Anyway, y'all, thank you so much. Y'all take care and have a great day. We'll catch you on the next one. Bye.